our newest product line that we launched at FDIC um, two years ago, so that would have been in 22 uh, is when we introduced this. In uh, 2022, we introduced tripods as a prototype. We took feedback uh, from there, redeveloped it, added several features, and have recently uh, launched them as a ready-to-go product and have hit the ground running with them. Had several Metro customers already come on board and uh, we're doing really good things with this tripod. It uh, has the ability to operate off of uh, commercially available batteries, very similar to our fan. So you got DeWalt FlexVolt batteries, Milwaukee M18, Milwaukee M28 batteries, and uh, Makita batteries as another option as well. Uh, you see behind me here that is mounted on our simulation truck. Uh, as you all are very much aware, the tailboard, if you will, and lights have been taken off there, but pump panel lights or the back of a commercial cab, this is going to be where this is going to go. Instead of having a push-up pole light for nearly the same amount of money, you've got a three-in-one light. So what this is simulating here is this, the DC power. So 12 volt off the truck has the ability to plug it in and operate this off of the apparatus. It also has the ability of operating off of AC power as well for continuous operation. So uh, replacing your pole lights or push uh, pole lights or tripods on the truck with this, but having the ability to unhook, take it and go and drop a battery in it, and now it's portable and it's very uh, maneuverable. One thing that uh, we took back that I absolutely love about this uh, tripod is this drop leg here. So we've got a drop leg which is going to allow you to set it up on hill sides uh, or even if you're working in a, a place that's got stairwells, it's really nice that you can drop that down. We've got some pictures on our websites. I don't have those stairs directly around me right now to show you, uh, but you can actually set this up on stairwells and uh, not take up a lot of the space, but also get lighting inside of there. Obviously, as most tripods do, this has got a fully positional upper head, so you can go anywhere from uh, uh, top to bottom, left to right with this. This one I got in my hands, a 40-inch version of the tripod. The 40-inch version of the tripod is going to go up to just over six foot tall. So using me as a reference, and the same message we're doing with the uh, command lights is getting that light above our head and casting it down so that the light's not coming at you full on and it gives you the ability to walk into the light without it blinding you. So uh, that's why this 40 inch tripod's doing so well for us is it gets it just over six foot tall. Some of you people are quite a bit taller than me. I'm not the uh, star NBA athlete, but six feet tall and then gives you the ability to cast that shadow down. Uh, so that you're not blinding everyone, but also folding it up into a nice condensed package that's lightweight that'll fit in compartments. Now the 50 inch version of the tripod is what's right beside it. 50 inches is obviously 10 inches more. This is going to get a little bit harder to stow in most compartments, but this is primarily suited to be on the outside of the vehicle to replace that uh, pole light we was talking about. Uh, same features as the uh, last 40 inch, it's going to have a drop leg, give you the ability to set it up off terrain uh, and all that. One quick feature uh, that I'll highlight for you is that removable head. So you've got the ability here to remove this head for either storage, if you're in a tight situation with compartmentation, non-reversible plug, so you don't have to worry about your firefighters getting this reversed around backwards, plugging it in backwards or anything like that. These here are Wayland Pioneer Pluses, FRC Mini Spectras, obviously high vis We also offer Akron Rebel uh, LEDs as well. We don't necessarily have a specific favorite, uh, again, but we do have the economical option available. So if someone's looking for a budget-friendly light for the bang for the buck, uh, we're typically going to lead them towards this or our Helios by Hivis. So those are our two most economical light hits. Uh, this one uh, gives a little bit more light and is right about $100 more than the Helios. So that's kind of where we land at that is you're able to get uh, almost 3,000 more lumens for 100 bucks.